Oh, why am I? <clears throat> hey everyone, and welcome. If you're new here, my name is Christina. If you're not new here, my name is still Christina, but I'm really glad to have you back. Today's video is going to be the start of the holiday season. And I decided to start with the movie Spirited. I very much do like Will Ferrell, and I very much do like Ryan Reynolds. I know they're not everybody's cup of tea, but Elf is one of my favorite all-time Christmas movies. So, I'm going to watch this. I will admit, I'm not a fan of musicals. And I know this is a bit um, musical-y. Hopefully I don't hate it. Anyways, if you guys like this kind of content, I hope you will give this video a like, comment down below, and of course, subscribe. Because in case you didn't know, subscribing is cool. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, ring that bell for notifications so you get notified for new uploads. Oh, also quickly, uh, I do have a P.O. box now. I do, I do. I will put it in the description box. And um, yeah, if you want to send me a letter or I don't know, but it's there if you if you decide you want to use it. Thank you for everybody who suggested that I open one. I appreciate the support. And um, yeah, I mean, other than that, what do you say we get into the movie? Without further ado, let's get into Spirited. Jazz hands. Let's do this. Yes, I am in a onesie. I do love my onesies. A little, little holiday-ish. It's got little penguins on it. And it's got a hood too. I hope you enjoy the look because it's it's all for you. Also, I tried to decorate for Christmas or the holidays, I'm sorry, but the lights just weren't coming out right. I'm gonna try it again. So hopefully next video will be more holiday seasoned. I'm rambling because that is what I do best. So uh, let me shut up and start the movie, okay? Okay, okay, okay. Do people really change? I mean, real, lasting, positive change? I sure hope so, because we are in the business of change. Is that the Grim Reaper? Who you pointing at? It ain't me. I'm sorry, I, I, I won't yell at the neighbor's kids anymore. <laughs> I, I'll take back the claim against the Johnsons. Is that Rose Byrne? Don't worry about her. In a few minutes, she'll wake up in her bed, dry, rested, and hopefully a whole new person. All right, she's back in bed. Can I get a coffee over here? Can I get a coffee over here? This is just a supernatural simulation. And that's me, Mr. Brad Pitt. Hmm. I'm the ghost of Christmas present. I'm not Brad Pitt. You think she changed? Yeah, I don't know. This one was a serious tight ass. Of course she's changed. Is that Tracy Morgan? So this is like a Christmas carol? Okay. And this is the moment we worked all year for. Oh, it is Rose Byrne. We'll take the game down the street. We don't want any trouble today. Do you want to play? Me? After all the times I've reported you to the HOA or called the police or stolen your packages. <laughs> you did what? <laughs> I love Rose Byrne. Congratulations, Miss Blansky. You're a different person now, Karen. Oh my god, her name's Karen. <laughs> so that's what we do. We haunt someone, change them into a better person, and then we sing about it. You wait for the day, you prep for a year. Okay, I think I'm gonna like this movie a lot. Why are they singing? Oh, because this is a musical. We're full of that Christmas morning feeling. One last faithful human. Oh, I knew the word. But it's a natural 
Oh my, it's like we're all on Molly. <laughs> Clear out our search history after we die. I love that her name is Karen. But don't you want another crack at life? God, I miss drinking. Huh? I used to go so hard with my girls back in Tampa. Wait, aren't you in HR? I have a tram stamp on the front and the back. We were crazy. We stole a cruise ship one time. Look. HR, I don't know if that's the right area for figgy you. Figgy pudding. It says in your file that you liked figgy pudding. Don't you want to try it again? Don't you want to go back on Earth and do person stuff again? I could go back to Earth. Retire. Just peace out. Just peace out. I meet a nice gal and we get married and start a family. We have a loving embrace. One of those newfangled modern mouth kisses. What is he like from the 1800s? Could I really be someone better? Someone kinder. Am I just full of shame? Look at this place, mate. Every single one of them's a soul that we've redeemed. Dolly Parton. Have people changed? No, that's the good news. Oh, Octavia Spencer. People never change. People are one. Lazy. We only care about ourselves. We're bringing back Christmas. We're bringing back cheer. We're bringing back Christmas. If we change him, imagine the ripples. He's not an unredeemable because he drowns puppies. You know it's been done before, once. Who was it? It begins a full year of research and preparation, creating one man's past, present, and future. The documented fact that one person's kindness can have a ripple effect. If we can redeem this unredeemable, imagine just how far these ripples could go. Billie Eilish, Ed Sheeran beef has been approved by management on both sides. Billie Eilish and Ed Sheeran beef? Oh, and your niece is here. Apparently, she'd like your help with something, but Owen didn't say what it is. She get the phone I sent? Mm-hmm. Hoverboard? I'll just go tell your late sister's only kid you're too busy. I was thinking maybe I would run for student council president. Maybe you could help me. Wow. That's, I mean, either that requires someone who's very... Mm. You know, you've always struck me as someone who's more of an inside voice type of person. So what makes you want to run for student council president? I think I could make the school way better. 100%. If they pick me, but they probably won't. Probably not. I promise, Carrie, if Ren ever needed anything, you would help her. He's actually super nice. Yeah, he's a okay. great kid. I will put you over my knee. Opposition research on an eighth grader? Sure. I'm just gonna stay on her just in case this turns into an important story. Oh, he's got a crush on Octavia Spencer. When your parents make you a Christmas dinner with homeless people. Gross. I'm doing oppo research on a child. That's the view from here. Go Octavia. Look at me, MVP employee of the year. Beautiful shot. Pretend I don't care when nice people get hurt. We quit. There's a line you can't cross. And I think this is it. Walking away is a little bit harder to do. That's the view from here. Octavia Spencer has a great voice. It's official. I'm a terrible person. No, you're not. Can she see you right now? Have we met? I don't think so. No. Huh. Well, then how do you know how terrible I may or may not be? We have to kill her now, right? <gasps> I'm here on a project. I'm the ghost of Christmas present. Yeah, we'll be haunting him this Christmas and you got to be hope that we can change him into being a more positive force for humanity. <laughs> Clint. <laughs> Clint. <laughs> yeah. I'm Kimberly. Roberto C. Fishman Pratt. Roberto C. Fishman Pratt? Okay, it's a bad name. I would be freaking the fuck out right now. Yo, Jesus! Uh, this chain I forged in life is girded of 
my own free will. Link by link with each soul I made to suffer. This is not a dream. God, you're ugly. Many wrongs have ye to right. Past, your present, and your future. Glory of your life shall now unfold. Glory of your life. The truth you're scared to hear. I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm stuck on the on the on the first thing there. The, you said past, present, future. A Christmas Carol? The Dickens story? The Bill Murray movie with Yes, like the Dickens book and the Bill Murray movie and every other adaptation nobody asked for. <laughs> no, that nobody asked for. If you would just let me get this out. You might rewrite the out of all the people on the planet, murderers, racists. I'm the guy you're gonna haunt. If you would shut up and let me finish. <laughs> Forget it. It's not worth the trouble. Three ghosts coming to save you. Bit more consideration for them than you did for me, maybe. Yeah. The guy is a level 20 pain in the ass. I'm the ghost of Christmas past. You're not what I was expecting. No? How so? I mean, you're you're lovely. Ooh. Ooh soft. soft. Jinx. Jinx. I'm tired of being just a guy who points at stuff. Some catchphrases I want to try out. Check these out. Welcome to the bone zone. Bon appetit. Ha! Or my favorite, you big Christmas carol, bitch. Why aren't you on the haunt? Yeah. One thing led to another, and... Uh... Please tell me you're kidding. I'm your ghost of Christmas present. Present? What are you doing in my past? Well, your haunt got off to a bit of a humpy start. Yes, it did. So I will be handling both past and present this evening. Look, Colonel Sanders. I haunted him, yes. Jerry, Mom said we get a little present tonight. You got me a puppy? Where is he? He's sleeping in the kitchen. Oh, my God. How many times have I told you to close this kitchen door and you come back in? Oh, jeez. This is a Christmas tragedy. Oh, that's really messed up. That was the single best Christmas gift that she or anyone else has ever given me. I wanted a puppy so bad that it was better to believe I had a lost dog than no dog at all. Plus, I never left the door open again, so, you know, win-win. Boy, that Nora was a keeper, huh? Wonder how it all works out with her. Is that a Sephora? Yeah. Those didn't exist. We have a deal with them. If anyone's looking for a gift for me. What? Shit. What? What? How? With who? With me. I'm done waiting around for a good man. Are you happy for your sister? No, not, not really, no. I love you, but you have no clue how to be a mom. Your sister was always really good to you, wasn't she? You are incapable of putting anyone ahead of yourself. Goodbye. I have never once had to put up with this level of bullshit from a perp. A perp? Perp. You fabricated a scandal. We're gonna get our client elected. And destroy that woman's life. Me. I didn't build this company so I wouldn't be able to look my kids in the eye. He built this company with honor and integrity and you destroyed it. Hey guys. I need to ask you a favor. No, we're not doing this. No. This is a key moment. No, no. You got a runner! Everything's cool, back to work, everyone! That memory in the hospital, that, uh, that's, that's what we call a kicker. It's a, it's a key moment that has to be faced in order to, you know, affect any real change. What are all these pictures of my executive VP doing up here? Do you Photoshop yourself into this one? Did I? I don't think so. You've been at this 200 years. Is mankind getting any mankinder? Let's go! Right now! You asked if I was ever alive. Yes. Mr. Scrooge? And I have nothing for you, boy. So good afternoon. There's no call for that kind of language, sir. Holy You're telling me the Dickens story is Please, is based on you. He was Scrooge? Oh, I did not see that coming. The only other unredeemable to go through the program. So I do understand the weight you carry. Bravo for that twist. Whatever. You were Scrooge. The ghost changed you, but you never relapsed. The rest of your life, not one single humbug ever again. The rest of my life. The rest of your life, I mean. Roughly three and a half weeks. Years. What? <laughs> You're kidding. No. Really? Uh-huh. Yeah. Why did all those people get offended? 
when he said good afternoon. In the 1800s, good afternoon was a sick burn. More or less meant F you. Really? Extremely graphic. Your accent blows. Well, I beg to differ. And pout? Just let your inner Scrooge come out. And sweetly say... Good afternoon. Well, I never. Just let one fly and you'll be smiling pretty soon. So you've done nothing wrong in so very, very long. No, you want to try it. Better to never let all of the bitter be bottled up and so... Oh. Come on, bub. He's got it coming. Come on. It's right there. Good afternoon! Good afternoon! You smell of shite! I'm an orphan, please, sir. May I have some more? Good afternoon! Deplore them with the call them like a Judy bloody Dench. Judy Dench? Was that Judy Dench? Oh my god, she's a national treasure. <laughs> Good afternoon. If you're short, then you can kiss my dickens, son! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Kiss it! Charles Dickens, it's a fun <gasps> yes, thank you. thing. But there is, is a real. baby. <gasps> There's a baby. <laughs> you could. I am so sorry. He should be. You could suck my dickens, son. Good afternoon! Good afternoon! Good afternoon! Oh, he's dead. Yeah, he's dead. Oh, that... No, no, he's fine. He's good. Well, he's well, not a squirrel anyway. A world please. If he could see that I was an unredeemable too. So you thought it might be a fine idea to take him on a little field trip. Into your own past? I should have made you take your retirement package when you asked for it, rather than risk everything on this unredeemable. Good afternoon. Excuse me. <laughs> huh? Good afternoon. <laughs> it wasn't me. I heard it too. I don't know what that was. Oh, I'm going to start saying that all the time now. I am the ghost of Christmas present. I got to go by the book now. What do you mean by your retirement package? My retirement package, if I were to choose to collect it, is a gold watch, a Sephora gift card, and the chance to return to Earth and live out the rest of my life as a mortal. A Sephora gift card. First stop. We were just here. <laughs> if it isn't the ghost of Christmas present, you must be here to haunt Clint. So she can see you. I love your costume, Rudolph. Oh, thank you. You look adorable. Are you five years old? Get down from there. This is, this is a homeless they shelter. Can't see us. Am I supposed to know this kid? That's Josh Hubbins, know. whose life you told your niece to cancel. Oh! 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 <laughs> Uncle Owen looked like a freaking stoner from the 70s. Looks like Ren's trying to decide whether to take her uncle's advice. She's probably not even going to post it because she takes after my sister. And she posted it. Do you want to see some more things you're wrong about? If you want to make your school a better place, you're going to have to accept certain uncomfortable truths. No. 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 Look, this is... <laughs> This is good. There's a lesson in there, you know. If you're gonna run for office, your past is fair game. He posted that when he was in sixth grade, you butt crack. He was 11. I, I don't want anything to happen to the kid, okay? I'm not a monster. Stay with me, Clint. Stay in it. Oh, come on, don't do this. I'm here with you the whole way. I need to ask you a favor. When I'm gone, I'd like you to take Ren. You're not gonna go anywhere. You know, even if even if, if even if you did, would you not? Okay, I'm not. I'm not the dad type. I'm really not. Our sister has something that she wants to ask you. It's a favor, I think. Mm -hmm. uh, oh. Wow. Okay. We're family. I'll do anything for you. Thank you. I know that wasn't easy, but you faced it, and that took guts. And I'm proud of you. Come here. Yeah. Your final ghost. We'll be right with you. Hold on, you don't you don't get to make me relive the worst moment of my life and then just F O. Good afternoon. Uh, oh no, you know I find that triggering. Am I forever unredeemable? He takes his retirement right now. All right, that's enough. Back to bed. Your time, Jacob. <laughs> 
就说。You have uh, indoor plumbing. Can I? This is amazing! I have always wondered what this would be like, and it does not disappoint. Can I do this every month? Everyone can see me. Yes. Hello, <laughs> you can see me. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> you look stupid. Okay, you look you know, stupid. You Elf reference. Oh my god. You're back, and in a boldly tight suit. It is a little snug. No, I, I like it. It's... Ugh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Is that okay? <laughs> Aww. He's holding my hand, and he's not letting go. He's got a good heart. But I don't want to fall, but have it all fall apart. That's the view from here. When I used to date, holding hands was third pace. <laughs> this woman's as kind as a human could be. That's the view from here. That's the view. From here. She did it. She, she she looks presidential up here. Let her go with a little gavel. What's going on? Oh my god. Please don't tell me that kid committed. Wait. What are you telling me, the kid? How was I supposed to know that he would do something like this? Shit. This is an easy one. I can fix this one. You don't speak. You just you just pointed things. Why don't you point to the way out? See the movies. I know the drill. <laughs> you made my best friend quit. You made Christmas Carol bitch. Good afternoon, gentlemen. Oh, you want to go, wise ass? <laughs> When they were doing my future, there was this little sick kid. What did they call him? It was Tiny Tim. Sweet kid, one crutch. No. Nope. Little Larry. No, Tiny Tim. Little Larry little was Larry, dead. Little Larry was my fault. Little Larry was fine. Little Larry. Tiny Tim! You killed Tiny Tim. I did what I should have done the minute you asked me to dig up uh, dirt on a child. I told Rin that her choices make her who she is. I finally quit! There's a line you can't cross. And guess what? This is it! You are killing it right now, but did Ren post the video or not? No, I didn't. She didn't yes. post it! Because you're good like your mom. Thank you. You have no idea the good that you've done. I know I don't say this enough. I love you too. Bring it in. Yeah, okay. Something very special is about to happen. Just, just hang on. <laughs> no, no, you guys won't be able to see it. They're supposed to be singing. It's the big climax. Marley! I told you I didn't change. Why isn't this happening? Probably because I'm, I'm going to go back to work next week, and I'm going to keep doing what I do. I, I'll go back, and, and we'll, we'll figure something out, and, and, and you'll change. I thought that we were really becoming... Becoming what? I thought we were becoming... Bros? I was going to say friends, but bros. Yeah. Never had a bro. Well, you got one now. Your bro is telling you to calm down and come go ice skating with your new girlfriend. just jumped in front of a bus to save someone you care about. My bro. Your bro. You strip them down right to their core and find a self-centered prick. I put me before you. 
but you didn't. Guess I didn't. So can we do a little good? Work a little harder than you did the day before. Just a little, just a little, just a little. Tim! Thank you. Clint! Clint! <clears throat> Damn it, that hurt! What the hell? Is it over? Sure felt like a finale to me. <laughs> no, 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 no. Whoa. Whoa. Why is everyone standing around? I'm gonna do some CPR! We just became pros. Your sacrifice would have no meaning if it had no consequence. This ending sucks. It's not the end, Clint. My heart is beating so fucking fast. Oh my God. I'm so proud of you. Don't be scared. Oh, why am I... <clears throat> wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no just one second, one second. Here's the thing, here's the thing. A little idea, a little out of left field. Hey, yo, Chief, I'm going to hit the food truck. You want a street taco? Yes, please, and thank you, buddy. Good to see you, big sister. Oh, hey, Clint. <laughs> this profile is driving me nuts. I just can't find a heartstring we can grab onto. You mind if I take a peek? Don't use it as an excuse to come home late tonight. Well, that hurts. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Can't build it Dad. if I keep dropping the damn screws in the ground. Ronald J. Fishman Pratt, put it down. Bring it in, bring it in, bring it in. That never gets old. <laughs> see that Rennie got into the master's program at Stanford? I hear that. I do too. Is it reprise? It's reprise. We might be dead, but we're living that Yuletide dream. Never test the waters, we'll never know just how far the ripples go. Consider the consequences. Consider the possibilities. We want to make the ripple. I'll never say good afternoon to you. What you're about to see is a Channel 4 News exclusive. I love you. movie over i absolutely fucking adored this movie oh my god i was a little hesitant because of the musical aspect but the songs were great and the singing was great and everybody did an amazing job and the dancers and the taps and the just the whole the whole atmosphere was so good. Honestly, this is, for me, an instant classic. Is up there with, like, Elf. This was so, so, so good. Will Ferrell, uh, Ryan Reynolds, Octavia Spencer was amazing. I, fucking Judy Dench was in it for, like, a second. I'm never gonna stop saying good afternoon. <laughs> and honestly, I didn't expect it to put me through 
through the the emotional roller coaster that it did. Too much getting hit by a car. Uh, like my heart is racing right now. Even oh my god, it's like I died. Like I anyway, I, I did not I did not like those scenes. Um, do not want to rewatch those at all. Um, no, thank you. But that's my, my own trauma. It had a lot of emotion. It had that Christmas spirit. It had the Christmas atmosphere. It had the vibe. It had the um, magic. You know, the this is going to sound so ridiculous. but And I haven't felt this way in a while. But Christmas used to, around Christmas, the vibes always felt like magical. Every Everything felt better everything felt different and it was like people were nicer and more jovial and 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 it had this just this atmosphere and that's what this movie had it had all of that the magic of christmas i loved that will ferrell (laughs) turned out to be ebenezer scrooge (laughs) that was fucking great that was that was really great it had a a lot of great jokes i think the only part of the movie that i was just like was the um the christmas past girl being like obsessed with ryan reynolds that whole oh was he asking for me and oh what does his hair smell like and oh you know it just kind of like brought me out of it didn't need to be in there all right you guys slept together and then we could have just left it alone and then at the end sure you guys end up together it didn't need to have like fucking seven different scenes of you asking questions about him if he's thinking of you (laughs) or that was a bit um that was a bit stupid for me for me for me some people might find it cute. I don't know. I just thought it was annoying and stupid. Other than that, I'm not really... It was great. I would highly, 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 highly recommend watching this. Just give it a chance. Honestly, give it a chance. If you don't like musicals, hopefully you will be shocked by how much you like this movie and how much you truly actually enjoyed the musical numbers. Because I really did. I legitimately jammed out every single one except for like the really slow ones where obviously i'm not like (laughs) i don't know what else to say about this movie it was just it was good and i'm it was spirited and i'm in a i'm in a good mood after watching it also just off topic i have these lights down here That's red. This is actually green. But for some reason, the light is making it look like it's like a teal color. Not really sure why that is, because it's a legitimate green. (laughs) And this kind of looks orange, actually, not so much red. I was trying to do a red and green Christmas, but... Anyways, greatly exceeded my expectations. It was actually, and also it was, it was just really well made. The production on this, the the dance numbers, the choreography, the the set, the all of it, the costumes, so good, so good, so good. It doesn't feel like it's some kind of cheap streaming movie. Anyways, hope you guys like my onesies. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you guys thought of the movie. If you saw it, please do comment down below. Let's discuss. I hope you will subscribe. And uh, until next time, I will see you guys in the next one.